tragedy struck as Tafari Campbell, former President Barack Obama's personal chef, drowned near the family's residence on Martha's Vineyard. Massachusetts State Police confirmed the identity of the paddleboarder whose body was recovered from Edgartown Great Pond on Monday as Tafari Campbell, 45 years old, from Dumfries, Virginia. While visiting Martha's Vineyard, Campbell, who had been employed by the Obamas, met with this unfortunate accident. It's worth noting that the Obamas were not present at the residence during the incident. In a heartfelt statement, the former president and his wife, Michelle Obama, expressed their deep sorrow at the loss of Campbell, whom they considered a beloved part of their family, the Associated Press reported. The couple reminisced about their first encounter with Campbell when he served as a talented sous chef at the White House, showcasing his creativity and passion for food's ability to bring people together. Over time, they came to know him as warm, fun, and exceptionally kind individual who brought brightness into their lives. When the Obamas were preparing to leave the White House, they asked Campbell to remain with them, and he graciously accepted. Since then, he has been an integral part of their lives, making the news of his passing all the more devastating. The search for Campbell's body was temporarily halted on Sunday, but then it was resumed on Monday. With the aid of sonar from a boat, the police located his body approximately 100 feet from shore, submerged at a depth of about 8 feet. Tragically, Campbell was not wearing a life jacket at the time. Survived by his wife and their twin boys, Campbell leaves behind a grieving family and a community touched by his presence.